Hello guys, uh, this is a short tutorial on how you can find out the files that you have downloaded through XBMC uh, Droidbox. So, uh, after you download it on your device, uh, whether that is from Genesis add-on or something else, you can, uh, you can search it out through ES File Explorer. So, just open the ES File Explorer, which you can see right here in the corner. From your apps, you can, you can search it out. So just click on uh, ES File Explorer. It will open up the main page of ES File Explorer, and then after that, you can see at the top left corner the three. There are three dashes. So click on one of them. Click on it. So once we click on the three dashes, it will open up uh, another window. So in this window, you need to make sure that before you search for the file that you have downloaded through XBMC, you need to make sure that if you want to search that file from ES File Explorer. Uh, you have to go into tools and you have to turn on the show hidden files option so you can see I have turned on the show hidden files option so if it is off like this you just need to click it on and that's it so after that is done go back uh, one step and this is the main and this is the main uh, screen of ES file explorer and at the bottom uh, you can see there's a search option with a magnifying glass just click on it and it will bring up the keyboard and you can type out uh, the file for example I had just downloaded recently prison break so I will just try to search out with some keywords like prison I had I had uh, downloaded an episode of this drama serial so I will just type prison and uh, click search from the keyboard okay I have pressed search from the keyboard and it's showing uh, empty folder file not found try deeper search so you can see at the bottom is showing file not found try deeper search. so we'll click on this try deeper search so it's searching out uh, the prison f uh, prison break uh, episode file uh, so I think um, I, I'm sure exactly that it will search out this file you can see it has searched out the file and then you can go into it or copy the file uh, whatever you want so just if you want to copy the file just hold on it and uh, at the bottom you can see there is a copy option but if you have the remote you can do it with a remote so copy it and if you need to paste it into your external uh, external SD card or you have a uh, you have a USB uh, USB device so you can see all those devices in inside local option uh, once you click on the three dashes in the top left corner it will display this and inside this you can see external SD card SD and all these things all these um, areas of storage so you can move this file anywhere you want whether I, if I want it to be in the external SD card I can just uh, paste it here so you can see that the post paste option is coming in the bottom left I will just click on it and it will paste it in here so then you can um, then you can take out the USB card or the SD card and uh, copy it to over to your computer your laptop or wherever you want so that's it for this uh, short tutorial thank you bye bye